Hi guys, Dale Bateman here. On today's episode of Build Your Success Online, I want to answer the question that everyone has. Does it honestly take money to make money? Stay tuned to find out. You've probably heard people say this to you, uh, especially if you've mentioned to them, maybe it's your friends or your family, that you're interested in starting an online business. They'll say to you, well, it takes money to make money. Well, guys, I want to show you a different angle on this and allow you to make your own decisions. Now, I will agree with that statement. It does take money to make it, but it's how you approach it and how you put into action exactly what you're going to do to make that money and have a successful online business that makes all the difference. So let me go through a quick presentation for you that I've put together that I hope will help shed some light on this very controversial question. Here we go. So guys, let's explore this a little bit more and answer this question. It takes money to make money online? The truth is, and I want you to remember this statement, the truth is that's something that poor people tend to say so that they can have an excuse for why they can't make any money. They don't have any to start with. All right, let's repeat that. The truth is that statement, it takes money to make money online. The truth is that's something that poor people tend to say so they can have an excuse for why they can't make any money. They don't have any to start with. So, how do you go about making money if you don't have any? Well, guys, you need two things. You need knowledge and you need action. That's what you need when you don't have any money to start with. Now, let me explain each of these to you in more detail. Knowledge. The knowledge part is actually pretty simple. Your local library is filled with books that can help you learn to make money by starting your own business. Your local library also likely has lots of books that will take you, uh, will take you through the art of sales. And no matter what business you're in, guys, remember, you're in the business of selling. All right? Now, the second one, action. That's a little trickier. Once you've taken the time to learn how to make money, you actually have to apply this knowledge. This is one complaint I have with the book Think and Grow Rich. It's a great book that everyone should read, but there's a flaw in the book, and that is it doesn't tell you the action that is required to make money and get rich. You can think about it all day long, but if you don't take any real steps into achieving a goal, it's not going to happen. And that's why I'm going to go through my third step here, my third point, my third bullet point, learn, do, teach. In order to apply what you learn, take steps to achieve your goals, you have to learn new things, like we did with the knowledge step just before this. Then you have to put those into action, take action and do what you actually learned. Then the final step is to teach other people what you have learned and what you've actually done. Okay, so this is a perfect example. I've learned this information that I'm teaching you today, all right? I've learned how to make money online without having any money up front, because that was my situation, okay? I've learned those skills. I'm having success. Now, I'm doing it. I'm putting it into practice. I'm creating an online income from basically nothing, all right? And now, what I'm doing is I'm teaching you how to do the same thing. You see how that works? And you can do exactly the same thing that I'm doing. In fact, I'm encouraging you right now, take action, re-engineer what I'm doing, learn, do, and teach. You're in the learning mode right now. Learn this stuff inside and out. Do it, take action on it, and make it happen for yourself so you can turn around and teach it to other people. And that's how you build a business online. Now, here's some online money-making methods. It's more of a progression, uh, things that actually work. Number one, affiliate marketing. Getting involved with an affiliate uh, company or companies is a great way for ordinary people like you and me to start making money on the web. 
the first thing you should do is find affiliate programs that offer products you're interested in promoting. If you're not interested in it, and you're not encouraged or excited by it, you're probably not going to push it. Then you can start an online business with a minimal investment or risk. Most really reputable companies have about a $25 uh, product that you can use as an entry-level product to get involved. Just make sure you find affiliate programs that will pay you a recurring residual income rather than programs that pay you only once per order. That's very important. Your startup investment may simply be registering for a domain name and paying for a web, web hosting account. But then what? You have to start marketing your products and getting people to your website. That's where we're talking number two, driving traffic to your site. Many people give up or just flat out quit when they learn that starting an online business is a demanding process that requires a substantial amount of hard work, time, commitment, and some money. So, a substantial part of your marketing investment will go towards building a mailing list of your interested products. That's number three, build a list. Now, it's been said many times by experienced marketers that the money is in the list. You have to build a mailing list of people who are interested in what you have to offer. It's almost impossible to sell to someone the first time they see your offer. Oftentimes it takes up to seven contacts or more before someone seriously considers your offer. And that's where number four comes in. Build relationships. Remember guys, you must build a trusting relationship with your prospects before they will buy from you. And in order to do that, you must have an effective email marketing program. You can also pay companies to bring targeted subscribers and leads to your list or website. There are many companies that offer this type of service. Now, I want to share with you a few of the great lead generating programs that I'm having success with building my list on. Okay? Um, yeah, here they are. My MLM programs. Basically, I have three. Empower Network, Pure Leverage, and Auto Recruiting program Platform. Okay? First off, Empower Network, it's a very, very powerful, huge uh, company, MLM company, multi-level marketing company, based around the process of creating a blog, uh, blogging on it daily, and showing other people how to do the same thing. Okay? Pure Leverage is another great MLM program whereby it's providing you with a suite of tools that are useful for online marketers. Things like an autoresponder, an email service, a video email service at that, even a conference room of your own where you can hold private sessions and webinars with small groups to get your points across to start doing that uh, learn, do, teach scenario that I told you about a little while ago. Okay? Finally, auto recruiting platform. This is literally, as it says, it recruits people onto your list on autopilot. Now this, at the time I'm, I'm filming this video, it's still in beta form. They're still working out all the bugs and getting this thing running and ticking like a clock. But once it's up and running, guys, you're going to see a lot of information out there about ARP. Okay, so get ready for it. Uh, when At the time you're watching this video, you may well have already seen a lot about it. Maybe you're already involved. But basically, it gives you the ability to set up your own custom sales funnels, and it will continually uh, rotate them for you on autopilot, giving them out to different, very targeted lead lists that you have access to only through the ARP program. So guys, those are things that I'm promoting. They are helping me to grow my list. Let's go right quickly back over these, uh, these, these steps, okay? Get into some affiliate marketing like I just explained. Start driving traffic to your site, build a list, and build those relationships to get people to eventually buy from you. So what's the bottom line today? reinvesting a portion of your profits, I recommend at least 20% into your business is a very important for your business to begin and then continue to grow. 
The key is to invest money into your business wisely while staying within your budget. If you believe in yourself and you and your business opportunity, you are bound to be successful. The internet has made this whole making money without money thing easier, but it also seems to have spawned a large group of lazy people who just expect the money to start rolling in as soon as they put up a simple little website or sign up as an affiliate for a product. There are a lot of free methods on the internet that you can use to advertise, but use them effectively you're going to need to know the art of sales. So take a drive down to your local library and get reading. But guys, rest assured that you really can make money online without having any to begin with. So I hope this has helped you um, to answer that question. It takes money to make money online. For more great tips and tricks, guys, anytime, you can head over to my blog at byso.biz and check out everything I've got to offer there. For now though, let's get back to the video, finish things up so you can get busy learning more, doing it, and teaching others how to do the same thing to build your success online. So, does it take money to make money? Well, I'm going to leave that to you. Now you have some information, you know some things that you need to do to put into practice, to start doing today, to start making money online and to build your success online. So guys, thanks so much for watching today. If you want to see more of my videos, the best way to do that is to subscribe. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and you'll get all my new videos every day to start putting into practice the things that I teach you right here. And you can also click over to my blog at buildyoursuccessonline.com for lots of great other tips, tricks, free stuff, and all kinds of things to help you with your online business. So until next time, my name is Dale Bateman and I'm wishing you a fantastic day. Bye for now.